Those old tape players, radios, and cameras gathering dust in your garage or attic may not be sparking joy. Shout out to Marie Kondo. But they could be reaping rewards. So we asked a pro auctioneer for tips on turning old tech into new treasure. $100 there, now I'm going to get one and a half, now $200, you're not going to be too Auctioneer bad. Roland Hill specializes in liquidating estates, selling everything from jewelry and furniture to electronics. So, as an estate auctioneer, I see a lot of electronics, and I see a lot of vintage electronics and things that are becoming very hot right now. Fast forwarding to the first spot on our list, reel-to-reel -reel tape decks invented in the 40s and popular through the 80s. Roland says that many audiophiles consider the sound of reel-to-reel -reel superior to today's all-digital format, and musicians are snapping these up to create modern music. Reel-to-reels will give you that drag sound, it'll give you that analog sound, it'll give you another sound to make mixtapes. He says look for brands like Akai and Tiak, which are hot right now. We saw this Akai go for more than three grand on eBay recently. The incredible new low-priced Polaroid land camera. Next on our list, we're focusing on vintage cameras from the 40s through the 80s. And Polaroids are coming back. They're the hottest thing out right now. You can still buy film for them online and in stores. Also, vintage cameras like these are mostly used for decor pieces these days. These cameras always sell at the auctions. You know, some sell for more than others. The cooler it looks, the more it brings. We found Polaroids going for nearly 90 bucks, while the older Brownie cameras are in the $15 to $50 range. Tuning in to our last piece of vintage electronic gear, old radios. Old radios are kind of hot, you know, because they're good decoration. <laughs> Roland says while brands like Westinghouse and Philco from the 40s are top sellers, also look for Sony and Panasonic from the 50s on up. Vintage is nostalgia. It's what we grew up with. It's what we know. What did we grow up with? Sony, Panasonic. We see these brands and we gravitate to them. This vintage Sony radio recently fetched more than five grand on eBay, which is where Roland recommends you check the value of any electronics you want to sell. Go to eBay, look up sold items, and see what they've sold for. Look up two or three of them to make sure the prices are consistent. Whether in your garage or attic, the hunt for vintage electronic treasure is on. This looks like a lot of fun, doesn't it? 